All right, it's chip of the day. We've got an NTE 1884 and an NTE 1823. Now, these are weird voltage regulators, but only like half of a voltage regulator. They're really only kind of the pieces of a voltage regulator. You have to add stuff around it to actually make it work. And uh, these were for some type of uh, consumer electronics and stuff, but they were in a module form. Um, you can see here on uh, one of the data sheets, the, um, the NTE is a replacement part, but the original part was a ECG part. A one, let's look at the 1884. It was a 12 pin SIP uh, that was a, a three voltage regulator. So it regulated 12.3 volts, 12.2 volts, and 5.3 volts. And I'm, I think it's probably plus and minus 12, but I'm not quite sure. But I'm thinking that's probably what it is. And then the other one is a four voltage regulator, uh, uh, the uh, NTE1823, which I don't seem to have any information on. But one of them is a three voltage regulator, one of them is a four voltage regulator in these weird SIP packages. So I think just the fun part though is opening them up and looking inside and seeing how pretty they are. So let's do that. All right, uh, here is the NTE81884. Um, and I conveniently already cracked the seal on it. So let's pull it apart here. So you can see uh, there are three big trans, uh, three big uh, pass transistors. So it's obviously uh, triple voltage. And not a lot going on, right? Um, let's uh, let's zoom down some. All right, uh, just to keep this easier to photograph, um, I'm going to show you the other part first. Um, this is the NTE uh, one eight two three. We'll open him up, and da 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 da. It's four. <laughs> so we got three, and we got four. So obviously, that's what's going on here. But uh, yeah, let's change the magnification and go down and take a look at these things. All right, uh, so you can see the uh, transistors here, um, the, the big ones. We got three of those, and of course they're all the same. These are Darlingtons, and uh, they are a chip on a on a big slab of um, heat spreader. Um, looks like maybe silver plated copper or something like that. And then there are little chips. Like we can see four of those little chips here, kind of five weight one over in the corner there, but here we go, four, four of those little little guys. So those are probably little bipolar transistors and um, diodes. And so we can we can take a look at those a little bit more. And here's some capacitors. There's a bunch of resistors that are kind of hard to see because they're deposited on the uh, substrate and then covered over with some type of uh, solder mask type of thing and so they're kind of hard to see here but it's a whole bunch of a uh, whole bunch of resistors also but yeah uh lots of stuff let's look at the uh, four transistor one one two three four yeah they're, and they're all the same right and they also have some little chips they look like basically the same stuff maybe a little bit different maybe a little bit but again, it's uh, just some discrete things like capacitors, but all of the uh, all of the resistors are deposited on the uh, on the um, on the uh, PC board type of thing. All right, let's get some, even closer here so we can see some of these chips. Okay, here's a here's a cute little uh, cute little bipolar transistor. Uh, I took apart a two N two 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 once and looked pretty much. Exactly like this little guy. Uh, here's a little guy. I don't recognize what he's doing. There seem to be some bipolar transistors that had little integrated diodes as well. So that's a transistor plus a diode. That might be what that is. Oh, here's another guy. That's interesting looking. Uh, and here it looks like some ring diodes. I don't know if those are zeners or what those things are, but little bitty diodes. That's kind of cool. And here's another one. So there's three, three diodes there. That's kind of neat. 
Uh, anything else going on? Yeah, there's these guys. Let me focus on one of those. Yeah, that's pretty nice. It's looking pretty good. And, oh, are they different? That one's, oh, this one's different. Oh, interesting. Okay. And that one, and that one. So three are the same, and one is different. One of these things is not like the other. Let's look at the other one. Let's see at this map creation. Let's see uh, what those look like. That's the same, and that's the same, and that's the same. So all of these are the same. This one has one. This one has one different one. Interesting. And I think the um, maybe it's higher current for this one. I don't know. All right. Let's uh, focus back down to. Uh, the fun zone here. Change the uh, change the focus again. All right. Make sure. Yeah, that's better. All these little guys. I like them. And we'll go back to the three. Go back to the three. Three voltage regulator. This guy, little guy. Hmm. Yeah, it's fun. I do like the diodes though. Those are kind of cool. Almost remind me of uh, of laser diodes, uh, vixels. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's go one step further and. See how quick, how close we can get. Well, here's one of those diodes up close. Looks kind of cool. Change the lighting here a bit. Yeah. All right. Let's see what else we can find. Find one of those. Now it's gonna be hard to find stuff. So because I'm so darn close to it. All right. I found one. It's got. Uh, oops. Hard to do the lighting up closer. Here, there we go. There we go. Turned on the ring light. That's turning out pretty good. Yeah. All right. That's those guys. And here's a little guy. Nice. All right. Well, there you go. A couple chips of the day are. Uh, Three terminal and our four terminal. Yeah, that's pretty neat. 